We received a lot of questions around ozone and herpes virus um, and whether or not ozone can in and of itself cure or eradicate herpes virus completely. So ozone is a very helpful tool that we can utilize to decrease the expression of herpes virus and decrease any kind of outbreaks and encourage it to go into dormancy. So herpes virus is going to exist in a couple different forms. Uh, it can either be oral or genital herpes, and it's going to be dormant when the immune system is able to handle uh, the viral load and keep it under control. When the immune system starts to drop off or when the individual is under um, some circumstances that cause the immune system function to decrease, outbreaks start to happen. When those outbreaks show up, we have a couple different options. We can either use some medications, we can use some supplements, or in this case, we can utilize ozone therapy to destroy the virus in circulation and bring it back under control, back under dormancy, so that the immune system can take over from there. Uh, we've had several patients that have had herpes outbreaks that we've been able to success successfully utilize uh, IV ozone therapy to be able to decrease the viral titers and bring it back under control. The ozone therapy that we utilize is a 10-pass ozone treatment. It is an IV ozone therapy uh, in which we will be drawing up the patient's blood and infusing it with ozone. That ozone gas has a lot of oxidative stress and it will destroy any pathogens or viruses in the blood. Uh, once we destroy those viruses, we flush that blood back into the system and the body is then able to remove those viral titers out of circulation safely. And that helps to decrease any sort of outbreak that the individual is experiencing. We're typically doing one ozo treatment at least per week for six to eight weeks in order to really drop off some of these viral titers. From there, it's up to the patient's immune system to be able to control uh, any kind of viral outbreak from there. And if the patient is having difficulties doing that, there are a lot of treatment strategies we'll utilize through supplementation uh, in order to help them to control those outbreaks and prevent outbreaks in the future.